so empty and so quiet. Oh, it's you guys. Don't do don't do that. Wow, this is pretty pretty. It's, you know, if it weren't filled with dead bodies and gore and guts everywhere. It's okay, Shep. It's alright. You've got a big particle rifle. It'll be okay. It's alright. Just, you know, bypass this door. Would you guys stop doing that? Alright, I don't know which way to go. I guess go this way first. My name is Tashia Pori. I'm wounded. Bad. Give this to my bondmate, Weshra. Asked her to go to the Citadel and tell Weshra I love her. Tell her... Sorry we fought. I was an idiot. Didn't mean any of it, Weshra. Want... Want you to have everything of mine, okay? Love you. I love you so. <gasps> oh, that's... <sighs> it's definitely sad. It looks like it was another side quest item. Poor thing. Like I said, this whole building is gorgeous. It's just, you know, there's that whole creepy, dark, empty, blood-filled, gut-filled... An isolated fortress. The Adat Yokshi must have believed they were safe from the war. If they knew about it at all. They learned. Isolated fortress? Are you talking about a fortress of solitude, Yavik? Because that actually would be really nice it would be really nice right now if some superheroic alien came to our rescue. I wouldn't mind if Tom Welling showed up. Steve might be upset if Tom Welling showed up. No, Steve would actually be happy too if Tom Welling showed up. <laughs> Never mind. does look like, you know, the Fortress of Solitude could be here somewhere. Where am I supposed to go? This place is... Oh! A new enemy. Oh my gosh, what? <laughs> what in the world? That! <laughs> oh my god. That scared the bejesus, bejesus out of me. Oh, they can teleport. It's a banshee. Well, that makes sense. I'm trying to... Those things are so creepy looking. Kill it! Kill it with fire! Kill it! Oh, thank goodness. Oh my gosh, guys. This whole session. Oh. Whoa, there's more.
that used to be a person. An Asari. What have the Reapers done? That is just... That is messed up. That is just totally messed up. Of all the, you know, husk versions of, of races, the Asari are... The Asari are one of the more elegant, you know, I think, beautiful looking races. And it's kind of funny how the most what I consider to be the most beautiful races end up being the most horrifying looking husk versions. Wow. Uh-oh. You okay? I... thank you. I thought it was safe to come out of hiding, but they're everywhere. Who are you? And what happened to you? My name is Feller. I'm... I'm an Ardat Yakshi. The Reaper's monsters have been hunting us. They're turning us into... into those. Ugh. Ugh. Please. I saw them drag my sister Rila into the Great Hall. Please, help me save her. Poor thing. The last Ardat Yakshi I met could handle herself in a fight. How about you? Only our teachers know combat biotics. The Reapers didn't come here to find skilled warriors. Then what are they looking for? I... I think they can only make those creatures out of us... Ardak Yakshi. Not regular Asari. Oh, my poor Rila. Please help. Of course. I'll call... Uh, that's an interesting shot of Shepard's facial hair. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of... of you know, mustaches or beards, but I do like a little fuzz. A little five o'clock shadow, I think, is is pretty hot. Wait, what am I saying? We're pull yourself together, man. We're we're supposed to save save this poor girl and her sister from these freaky Ardat Yakshi banshee things. Come on, focus, focus, Shep, focus. Stop staring at Shep's gorgeous bottom lower part of his face. We have to do it fast. Asari Commandos left a bomb there. A bomb? But Rila could still be alive! She might be right, Shepard, but we must destroy the monastery. It's our home. And she's my sister! No! But... She's going to the Great Hall. Come on! You could have handled that a little better. Shep, you could have, you know, said something that didn't completely cause her to run away, but that's all right. Is there anything here? You'd need a crowbar to pry those doors open. This place was beautiful before the Reapers came. Crowbar, can I just zap it? I didn't think so. Yeah, I want out of this place. <laughs> uh, computer. Jethro, this is Galay. I've blocked extranet access. We don't need the students panicking about these Reaper rumors. Still, it will not hurt to tally our supplies. Please bring me an inventory before evening prayer. I'll contact Sessia later tonight to inquire what set the Asari to war. Go in peace. reach over there? Yes, I can. Nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where'd you guys come from? Seriously?
shotgun, which none of us use, so... Okay, so far so good, I think. Medical station. Stay on your toes, Shep. Keep your wits about you. have over here. Place is so creepy. Weapon bench, wall safe. Well, we're gonna blow up this place anyway. Might as well take all the valuables, I guess. I'm gonna I'm starting to sound like a Sumi. Matriarch Galay, I used your priority security code to forward a copy of the letters from this rogue Ardat Yakshi to the authorities on Thessia. These emails were caught in the Exonet filter before Valir and Ryla had a chance to read them or learn of their existence. I recommend we refrain from telling them this Morinth has been trying to contact them and from them and from making inquiries about their whereabouts. The women is wanted for serial murder in over twenty three systems. Yep, there's Morinth. With your permission, I'll arrange extra watches until Morinth's capture or execution. I'm worried that we've grown over reliant on the Justicars for our security. I would still like to know what tripped our perimeter alarms last week and I read the patrol's reports, but I'm not convinced that it was an animal. So Morith's been trying to contact Falir and Ryla. Ryla being that, um, Asari we just met. And it looks like they, the matriarch, decided to not give him the correspondence. Which, I think makes sense, knowing Morith. Please let me know how you wish to proceed, Superintendent Jethra. Or Superintendent Jethra did this. Not, not Galay. This was addressed to Galay. Jethra, I, I had the new girl put in a holding chamber. The Justicar who brought her to us, Justicar Fora, said she had trouble convincing the prisoner coming to the monastery was necessary. This may explain why the girl lashed out at her guards. She's lucky Fora wasn't here for that. The Justicar's code would have demanded an execution. I'll question some other Justicars on the level of coercion Fora is permitted to use by the code. This isn't the first time her captures arrived here terrified out of her wits, but it will certainly be the last. Matriarch Galay, or Galai, or Galay. Interesting stuff. Cannibals. 
guys. <laughs> All right. I want out. I'm such a pansy. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> It's okay. You guys probably enjoy it. I, I don't think I'd be... I don't think this would be um, particularly entertaining if I was just completely not terrified out of my wits <laughs> about this particular mission. Anything else in here? No. Nothing on these computers. <clears throat> Another dead commando. The Asari should have rid themselves of the Adad Yokshi. By rid themselves, you mean kill. My people would never let such monsters walk among them. They didn't care for the competition? Bleh. <laughs> mm. Touche, Liara. That was pretty good. Touche. <laughs> Kinda glad she said that to Yavik, that was great. No, no, Shep. Use the elevator controls. Hopefully Yavik and Liara made it into the elevator. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> Oh, there's the bomb. Med pack. And... We found our bomb. And Falaire. Rila, wake up. Rila's alive. She's not a monster. Please, let me wake her up. Then we can leave. Rila, Rila, it's me. It's my man. Yeah, that's fine. We can we can rescue her. Hopefully, she's not actually you know infected by you know whatever it is is turning these Asari into banshees. Can we not can we not talk to them first? I need to save. I haven't saved in a while, guys. Just to make sure. Rila? Uh, Rila, can you hear me? That's not creepy at all. <gasps> uh oh. Oh, here we go. Why did she do that? She is lost to the Reapers. Conversion has begun. Can we set off that bomb? We need a detonator. Commandos would have had one. We've got to find it. Oh boy. Later. There's, there's two of them. <laughs> I love how we're throwing grenades when there's a bomb right over there. <laughs> that's definitely... That's definitely a disaster waiting to happen. I'm just throwing virtually all of my grenades. For now, let's get back to that bomb. Uh, totally gonna get nightmares tonight. <laughs> 
Soler, go! Take the elevator! Rila, what, what are you doing? It's too late for me. There are hundreds coming. Just go! Oh. Move! No! Rila! I love you. Rila! Oh, man. Say goodbye. You said you'd help her. She could have come with us. I I tr I tried, I really did. But she chose to save you instead. You would have died if Rila hadn't sacrificed herself. She didn't want that. There must have been another way. We could have found a cure. It was too late. You don't know that. We could have tried something, anything. Oh. You should have left me with Rila. Stand down. I'm the last of my kind, and even now I'm giving you a reason to finish what the Asari soldiers started. I wouldn't do well in the outside world. Leave me here. But... Really? This place is ruined. Can you survive here? I vowed I'd never leave this planet. And I never will. If the Reapers come again, I promise they won't find me here alive. All clear. You can bring the shuttle around. I'll follow the smoke, Commander. See, this is why I sympathize for the Arda Yakshi. It's, they live a really rough life. Commander, I'm pleased to hear the Arda Yakshi situation has been put to rest. Should I guess you're our contact inside Asari High Command, Counselor? I'm merely here to convey the gratitude of the Asari people for concluding a difficult, sensitive mission. The next team of commandos we were sending to the monastery are now en route to Admiral Hackett instead. Farewell, Commander. Farewell. Wow. That was a pretty cool side quest there, guys. It was a lot more involved than I thought it would be. I believe I've been going for quite some time now, so I'm going to go end the session right here and... Don't worry, we'll be back with another Gay Let's Play Mass Effect 3 soon. Till then, love yourselves and love each other.